Hello everyone, thank you for joining us this Thursday as we as we continue our study in the book of John. Today we read John chapter 10, which is very interesting because it starts off with Jesus talking about the the sheep and the good shepherd and and how the the sheep they understand or they know the voice of that of the good shepherd and he says that there will be people who enter into the flock and, and try to try to uh, guide the sheep down a different way but the sheep know the voice of that good shepherd and 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 it, he tells the story to the pharisees and the pharisees don't understand so jesus has to be a bit more specific as to what he means and he tells them that the sheep know they have that special relationship with with the shepherd and that this is something that that he's pretty much speaking on on a him being the good shepherd and we being the sheep and that Jesus is there uh, taking care and guiding the sheep down the correct path and that he knows his sheep and the sheep know him as well. And Jesus goes on and, and he makes the, he continues talking to these people and he, once again, as he has been doing, he claims that he is a messiah he knows that he is a messiah and this is what he preaches he wants the people to recognize this and, and to some people they, they even said well if you are why don't you just tell us right the thing is that jesus had been telling them just that they weren't understanding that they they weren't uh comprehending what it is that jesus was saying and then jesus kept on uh saying and, and proclaiming that he is a messiah and as always these people were mad, right? They were mad that, that Jesus was claiming to be the son of God. And one of the things that stands out to me is, is in the verse, verse 37. He says, do not believe me unless I do the works of my father. But if I do them, even though you do not believe me, believe the works that you may know and understand that the father is in me and I in the father. This verse is, is, is very, it, it speaks a lot to the people there because they did not believe Jesus, but the works were undeniable. They could not deny the fact that Jesus was doing these works and that this power was something that they had not seen before. And I believe that power is the power that we still see today, the power of God to perform miracles, the power of God to transform lives. And this morning, I want us, I want to urge us to believe in the power of God and to get to know the good shepherd because we are that sheep. We are those sheep and we should recognize that we have one shepherd. And even though that there will be people who try to to deviate us, to, ma to make us uh, think other things or, or, or believe false um, teachings, that we may believe the good and one true shepherd, which is Jesus Christ, who who is here and, and is, is full of power and, and that we may continue to trust in him as well. So family, I hope you have an awesome, awesome uh, Thursday and God bless.